Morning guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video we are doing a Jaguar F-Pace S model. We've got a little bump of scuff to do through there. A little scuff through there on the corner and through there. Didn't know nothing about the black piece. Um, the, the customer just said I'll leave that. Uh, we've got a little chip up here that I found uh, and I showed the customer I didn't know nothing about it. I'm going to try and pull this bumper forward and see if we can get in now. Uh, but someone's been here before. This, is, this black trimming has been sanded. I have took pictures but I didn't notice and I didn't show the customer so I will do that now. And it looks like it's been sanded down there as well. So um, yeah, we'll get it sorted, it's not a problem. Yeah, it should be a normal, straightforward one today. Let's set you up. Let's get cracking. See you in a mo. Right, I popped a few of the bolts out the top here. Tried to pull it forward. We got it forward a little bit, but it's not quite enough. Um, don't really want to leave that bit up there. So I might pop the splash guard and release the corner of the bumper and see if it'll give us enough room around there. So I'm gonna have a little look, see uh, what's involved with that and crack on with that. See you in a moment. Right, not really what I wanted to do. So I've had to pop the corner off and pull it out past the headlight because we've got a little bit of damage there and some cracking up here. This is so tight, you can see it's wearing away there where the headlight is. Um, I need to, I can't leave that bit. So <laughs> the problem is we're gonna paint here. Uh, I didn't want to paint up there, but we're gonna have to work something out with the blend to sort that out. Um, Someone has been here before, underneath. It's not a bad job at all. I don't think I'm about to show you, but underneath we've got all runs up here. Um, so it's been done before, and this is where the little sanding marks have come from there, around here. I have shown the customer, told them that it's not me. Don't have responsibility for that. Um, so yeah, we're gonna try. Now I've popped that out, we can start prepping it. Uh, we're just gonna have to do it like that, try and clip it back gently without destroying everything. So, let's start sorting the prep out. See you in a moment. Some people just make my life hard. Can you see my man's blend? <laughs> he just stopped here on a number plate. I don't know if that's showing on camera. Look at it. Everywhere I look. It's a job. Looked like a nice job, to be fair. It's just... Ugh. Anyway, let's get cracking. I'm going to uh, have to bring my clear a bit further across under the number plate there. <sighs> right. Yeah, let's do it. See you in a moment.
There we go, guys. We're ready for a bit of primer now. Let's get that smashed on. for a bit of paint we have got <laughs> painting by candlelight right let's uh get all this color blended in and uh yeah i'll just leave it live out now. Right, let's get some clear coat on this thing. I'm using my water today. Um, it's got quite a flat finish on this. Um, the Vilbis is more of a factory peel. Can get it to lay flat, but I know I can get it flatter with this. We're gonna crack on with a big gun today.
There we go, guys. Yeah, I wanted um, a nice flat finish. So I used my eye water. And it just gave me what I needed. Looking quite nice. I'm leaving it here tonight. Um, the lady can't collect it till tomorrow, so I'm going to just polish it up in the morning. I've um, I've had everyone in today. A gazillion phone calls, and I've just been plodding along because I knew the lady couldn't collect it. I haven't rushed. I stopped. I had lunch. I've done all sorts of things today. Got stuff organised. <laughs> So uh, yeah, I'll um, put it all back together and uh, yeah, probably show you it tomorrow. Yeah. I'm gonna pack up and go home. I'm back here tomorrow doing uh, other bits. So yeah, no rush today, just been plodding about. So yeah, see you in a bit. Well, I'll see you tomorrow, but I'll see you in a bit. There we have it guys, little tickle over. That is lovely. Yeah, it's got quite a flat peel. That's why I wanted to use my water so it all sort of matched in nice. I didn't have to polish a lot. There's a few little nibs, don't get me wrong. But, uh, polished my blend areas in. It's a shame because I tried to make that nice where it was rubbish before when I was polishing I was on the floor and I could see that's all peely as hell and looks horrible there that was nothing to do with us so yeah he's now sellable looking well I'll ring the customer give it back to them so there we have it guys another job jobbed that is it from me today I am uh, going to sort some bits out I'm going to go have a haircut, have a shave, a Turkish barber shop, and then chill for the weekend. So as always, a massive thanks for watching, and we'll see you very soon on the next one. Stay safe and be lucky.